All right, everybody, welcome back to the supermarket. Today, it's probably gonna be the finale. You know, all good things must come to an end, but the game, the gameplay loop on this, without modding it so the shelves restock automatically, is basically you ordering things and restocking the shelves and everything else just happens, which, you know, it's been fun, but after we keep doing this for, you know, another 10 episodes, I think we might grow tired of literally just the work. So today, we will finale things by maybe buying some random stuff and um, doing whatever it is that we feel like doing. So make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel to stay tuned for more other games like Minecraft, and uh, follow twitch.tv slash Sparkle to catch these live. We do need to get you trapped in your corner, though. So um, let's, okay, let's get this moved so he can come in. Get the restonks going, and then get this ready. This is what we have to do every single day. Please do not interfere, though. Please do not interfere with our boy getting inside the store. Okay, come on. Oh, the water is too expensive? Okay, guess you'll just be dehydrated then. Like, come on, bro. Let's be realistic about this. You can't just not drink water. I mean, Tibble 1200 bits also not caught up on this series. Did you ever make it to the roof? No. There is an invisible ceiling. No! Frick! He escaped, because the woman was in the way! God damn it! She was in the way when he was trying to get in. God dang it, if the customers are coming in at the same time that he's coming in, then it fricks everything up! Get back here, man. Get back here. I gotta trap him inside. All right, get ready, get ready. Get in there, and then... No! There we go. All right, now. As soon as he goes for box disposal, as soon as he goes for box disposal, then we got it. No, don't go in there. Don't go in there, customer. You're gonna frick up his pathing. He needs to be trapped once again. Okay, here we go. Dis, oh yeah, 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 get rid of that. No, lady. Okay, is he stuck? I think we might've got him. Did we get him? Did we get him? Yeah, we got him. Dude, we know how to do the setup now. Let's go, baby. All right, all right. We got 3,200 smackaroos. Dude, this is, this is profit. This is what I'm talking about. Okay, so what are we looking at right now? I'm just like, I do need to keep the shelves re or, uh, uh, stocked reasonably well, but at the same time, I need to focus on some other things today. All right, we need to get uh, chicken, a couple of uh, big, big flour. Okay, big flour, add to cart. We'll get ourselves a, we'll get ourselves a chicken, perhaps, and then we're going to get ourselves... A little bit of uh, two piggies and coffee. Oh, pasta. The pasta as well. Boom, boom. Then a little bit of two piggies. Then a little bit of coffee to go with it. And let's order all that. People have been trying to call out for a very, very long time. The shipping is not free. It's just instantaneous. So I do apologize for um, freaking that all up for all of you. That I have been, by just ordering a la carte, I have been wasting money. Huge, vast sums of money. I could have been a millionaire by now, but instead, I am not. I am just a 3000 heir, which is quite frankly unacceptable and sad. Only having my $3,000, I can barely afford to buy my water. What am I gonna do? This is so tragic. So absolutely tragic. Okay, let's get these things restonked. But again, it's like, if we're being serious for a moment about the gameplay loop here, at this level, like this is the gameplay loop. And I feel like, um, I mean, obviously it's early access, but if I were to give feedback, I think that they should do something in order to make it so it's not just this forever and ever and ever just ordering things. Again, people have told me uh, there are mods that make it so this becomes automated, but it shouldn't be up to mods in order to make it so there's some gameplay variety when you get to the point where your stalker is doing things and your cashiers are, are doing things. So, um, anyway, that's, uh, that's just my feedback on stuff. Um, that said, what can we do? What can we do with our, our dollars, dude? What can we do with our dollars? Yeah, if they made it so that whoever is doing the delivery of the packages automatically puts it on the shelves, that would be like a huge benefit. Add a loading dock, right? That's what they should do. Make it so you can buy a loading dock, a big semi-truck backs into the loading dock, and then someone dollies the freaking things into the storeroom. 
Yeah, I mean, that's a lot more programming, but maybe they'll get to it. It's just, uh, I'm trying to be constructive, because otherwise it's fun. It just starts to get very repetitive at this uh, point that we're at now. So, let's see. What can we buy? What can we buy? We could buy uh, an additional section for 2600 Good God, dude. Store level 99, $160,000. Every single one of these sections is a 4x4 section. But this 4x4 section is $160,000. Holy frick. <laughs> oh my god, that's actually wild. That's actually insane. Um, expand. Oh, I mean, we could add a little bit more room into the grocery store, though. Let's go. We're going to make a big old purchase in the growth department. It's going to be awesome. Also, you know, if we're not planning on coming back... Can we just take out a loan, a small loan of a billion dollars? Bank. Basic loan, medium loan, professional loan. 25 days. Take loan. Yes, sir. That's what I'm talking about right there. Go into debt that you don't plan on paying off. The American dream. Woo, okay. From there, what could we do? What could we do? Um, growth, hiring. You know what? Oh, you need to be level 22 to get restocker number two. God dang it, I can't even do restocker number two. That's crazy. Um, I'm worried about getting more storage areas and freaking up my, my dude's pathing. But, let's, what happens if you do that? Let's see. Where did our, oh, did that unlock the additional storage place here? Oh, wow. Oh, it's... Oh, I see. Hey, we can go back and forth from inside of the store. I mean, that's kind of awesome. Yo, the people... The, wait, what? How are you getting through here? Wait, the people are coming into the store this way? Uh, Man, you guys are able to fit through small places. What are you, like, octopus or something like that? Just right through there? Impressive. That's very cool. Well done, guys. Um... Well, well done. <laughs> Wait, Shoplifters is coming to the game soon? This is not what I was requesting. God, <laughs> god damn it. Oh god, I need more Susu. Holy frick. You know what I should do? You know what? You know what I should do with all this newfound money? I should buy 10 of everything. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna buy 10 of everything and just start putting it all into the frickin' storeroom or something like that. Hold on. So... Can I, can I move this? Okay, I can move this over here. Yeah, this will be good. This will be good. We'll just start throwing things in places. How do I still not have lights on? Because uh, my... The location of my lights is actually kind of... Um, actually, you know, let's, let's make the storeroom even bigger now. Um, management, growth, storeroom, storeroom... Section four there. Oh, ho, ho, ho. let's go, baby. That's going to be so much storage. Um, but yeah, my lights location is is part of what is keeping the stalker in position. So it's it's slightly a problem to access the lights, and I can't move it. Otherwise, what I should have done is I should have just, before I, I got him trapped in there, I probably should have just, you know, done what I need to do. But anyway... Wait, I should do this. I should do the same organization here. Hold on. Ah. Okay, so we got the we got the fridge stuff over here. And then we got the we got the stuff next to it over here. And then we got the this stuff next to it here. So I can still try to figure out where to put my 10 of everything that I'm going to order soon. And then I don't think I can fit. Can I fit you? God, I can, wait, I can fit you. Oh, I can fit you. Oh, that's efficient as heck. Let's go. That is efficient as heck. And then you could do like, I don't know, do I, do I put it next to you here? And then you can do that. Are we all done? I think we're all done with the day. And then I'll have room for my excess. It'll be awesome. Move the light. Wait, can you actually move the light switch? Is that a thing? Where is it? It's like it's back in here. But dude, if I move this, he's gonna be, he's gonna escape. We can't have him escape. That's not okay. There can be no escape. 
All righty, bro. Let's go, dude. Uh, the tea and the butter are down in price. God, the butter is plummet ever since I've bought my butter. It is just plummeting. It's unacceptable. Oh my God, the tea has tanked. What are we doing here? All right, guys, it's time to order 10 of everything. I don't actually know if I can afford 10 of everything, to be fair, but we'll see what happens here. We're on our last legs. I'm not gonna be able to order 10 of everything. There's actually no way. I'm gonna order five of everything. Wait. Um, there we go. I'm gonna see what happens when I spend all my money. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I'm just gonna see what happens to the stack of boxes outside when I do this. Is that, that has stuff in it. Um, it's all gonna become one complete mess of boxes in the road. Okay, here we go. So that was there, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, order, boom. Although I won't order five of the stuff that I'm not actually selling, because that would be wasteful. That was the water. One, two, three, four, five. One, one two, three, four, five. Boom. And that was coffee. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. I guess I only need to count the first one, right? And then one, two, three, four, five. Brrrr. Yeah, purchase. Oh, this is so big. This is efficiency. One, two, three, four, five. And... And then one, two, three, four, five. And then... Don't need to order you, because you're expensive. That's never going to fit, but we'll order a couple chicken. Two, three, four, five. And two, three... And one, two. All right. Yeah, let's go. Okay, we would not have been able to afford 10 of everything. But, yeah, this is huge. Look at all of our goods. All right. This is why it's really fun to have to do this manually. Because, you know, this is a few days worth of food in here. And um, that's how many boxes you have to do. All right. But, hey. At least we kind of know where we're putting them and stuff like that. All right, here we go. We got the chicken. The chicken goes there. And then other boxes are just going to sit in the storeroom. They can't go on the shelves. The pizza goes, uh, uh I'm going to put uh, the pizza there. I could buy more store shelves as well, I suppose. There. I'm going to buy more storeroom shelves. Here we go. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Furniture. Another, uh, freaking, uh, where is it? Small rack. Add to cart. Purchase. I might need more racks. I'm gonna buy racks. I'm gonna buy so many racks. Then we got big boxes. <laughs> it's, it is a, I'm gonna be honest, it's a little obscene that I feel like buying five of everything doesn't actually last that long. And that is how many boxes you need to deal with? Guys, actually you have to automate this. This is insane. You actually need to automate this system. It's really not, it's not ideal. Very much not ideal. Okay, we got that. Um, <laughs> screenshot. Uh, there we go. The screenshot. Although I'm probably gonna do more of my my silly thumbnailage for the actual screenshot. So, yeah. Uh, but anyway, it doesn't actually matter like where you put things when you have the when you have the stalker, right? As long as you're maximizing the the usage of the shelf space. So. Like, you can kind of just throw things anywhere, as long as it stacks with the other stuff. And then we got the flare. And then we got the pasta. Oh, but the pasta's full, so we put the other pasta over there. And then we got the rice. Okay, very good, very good. And then we've got more of the eggies. Eggs go in there. And then peanut butter. At least our organization storage system is, is uh, I mean, it's effective still. We know where things are at. We know where the stuff goes. We can vroom it back and forth. And if I know where the stuff goes, just imagine someone I could hire 
that would know where the stuff goes and would be very good at it. I don't know where to put this. Um, there. Extra space. I'm gonna run out. But I guess it's only, the, like, the big items, really, that, that are problematic. Wait, no, that's... that's T. Oh god, I fricked it. There we go. Fix that. I think I actually jumbled up a couple shelves, which was a bit of an oopsie, but what can you do, right? Eggs... Eggies? Lots of eggies up in here. We're not running out of eggies. That's good. Peanut butts. Boom. I don't even... I don't think I will be able to get this all into place before the end of the day. And I bet that the customers are going to have bought all of it. Freshly run over boxes. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. Where's my... There's my Wawa. Oh, yeah. Chalky Peak is there. Yeah, I switched those... I switched those shelves. Oopsie daisies. More French fries. More Narvalo. Boom. More pizza. No, don't have any. I'm going to start a new shelf for pizza. More Robert De Niro pizza, let's go. More pasta, let's go. Another thing that would be beneficial if you could you could optimize shelving space a little bit more, because like as it is right now, some items are just they're just suck. They're just the big suck because they occupy an entire shelf, but you make like no money off of it, and it's just, okay, why Why do I want this? I don't want this. It's actually terrible doo-doo, but here we are. Okay, my two piggies is uh, there. Yeah, I, a shopping cart, a dolly, or something like that would be very useful to have. There's so many things that could be implemented in order to make life grand and awesome and cool. I'm sure that there's going to be some item, though, before we're done here, that is already going to be, like, out of stock. I don't know how it'll be out of stock, but it'll be out of stock, and I'll be like, you're kidding me. I just bought five of everything earlier today, and we are already out of stock? You cannot be serious. Oh, God. How did you get under the... You're not supposed to be there. Wait. Wait. Why is there milk there? You're not- that's Susu. Oh my frick. Oh, you know what happened? Oh, I don't actually know how the milk got there. That was weird. But, um, yeah, what happened is with the reversal. So I need to find some Susu. My Susu numbers are plummeting right now. Where's the Susu? Is that Susu? There we go. There's my Susu. Just drop the extra boxes in front for now. And, um, yeah, this is the game. <laughs> this is the game. God dang. It just, it just keeps going and going. More Susu. Oh my god, there wasn't, there wasn't enough. They have to use all the Susu that I added to the shelves. It just had to be used. Unbelievable. All right, bread. We got some Ron up in here. Where's Ron going? I hate the fact that I mixed up the shelves. I kind of fricked it up. Hold on. Let me let me rearrange the shelves really quick. Put you there. Move you to there. Ah, oh, god dang it. Stupid box. Frick! Yeah! Okay, now the config is the way that it should be, and everything is right in the world. Huh, <sighs> okay. Eggs. I might have ordered too many eggs. I might have enough eggs for them to spoil and then spoil again. And be good. Okay, we definitely ran out of that stuff. More Chalky Peak. More Chalky Peak is right there. Mm. Yeah, imagine a world where this happens automatically. What a world that it would be. Oh, wait, no, okay, there's more of that. More Chalky Peak goes down there, I guess. You know what actually would probably be better is start allocating. I would have been more efficient to take the big stuff and give it more shelves, whereas the small stuff like the coffee and the tea and stuff like that, I could just 
relegate to a single shelf and then add things like the Chalky Peak to that. And then I could also do things like more Susu could go below that. Would be better, would be better. But anyway, probably a little, too little too late there, but y you get what I'm saying. Oh, it's nine o'clock and uh, freaking everything is already, I haven't, I have not managed to stock the stuff. <sighs> hey guys, hey, you got a busy day, man. Thanks. Even with even with the two of you here, I just I well I guess especially with the two of you there, I, I cannot cannot keep up. I simply cannot keep up. No, we need two thousand bucks. Oh, good. Prices only go down after I buy things. How are we in a world where it is just deflation? It is literally only deflation here. It's so rare that things go up. I would say overall. Overall, I think prices have trended downwards, though, which is very unrealistic. They really, really need to get the inflation implemented correctly into the game. See, now I can put some extra bread there. Hi. Hello. How are you? You're doing such a good job. Here you go. Oh, wow. Thank you. That's so cool. Much appreciated. <laughs> I... Hmm, will I drink it now? I ordered five of everything, and, um... Yeah, this is my finale. But this is uh, basically when you get to the point where you have a like two cashiers and you have the stalker. This is all you do. You just you just th order yeah, stuff yeah, and I put it on a, shelves. A yeah, do you have your stalker like this? What is he doing? Oh, he's trapped. Why so you trap him? because he goes vroom. Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Where are my I customers? Really wait, 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 wait. I, I want you to see this. I want you to see this. It's the. It is. Extreme efficiency, okay? It's legendary. You only have one stalker? Yeah, check him, check him. Okay, check it. Alright, he gets rid of the box, gets the next one, and then and then and then he throws it out, and then he goes gets it, and then he goes How did you figure this out? <laughs> Experimentation. <laughs> See, you don't need to hire multiple stalkers. This is how you make it go zoom. Oh my god. I think it was burr. I think it was burr. Yeah. Oh. He, he, he basically restocks faster than you can actually stock the shelves. It's, that's the problem. That's great. My guy goes super slow. Yeah, but the, but no, but the issue is I. this is all I do now. I don't have, the, I can't do anything else. You this can. is this is the game. It is merely restocking shelves. The only way to get out of this cycle of doom. Why are customers walking into your stuff? <laughs> what are they? What? Well, because they can't go in the front what? door. Why? Uh, because it is that way. Why? Why not? They're seeing all your nasty boxes. Whatever. Okay. Oh yeah, I should. Put extra stuff over there. I could have organized my sh storage a little bit better to where uh, I put the small things like only in um, in occupying less shelves and the big things occupy more shelves. And but it's 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 tedious. It's extremely tedious. If only you could carry multiple boxes. Yeah, that would be nice. Seems odd that you cannot. Yep. Um, did you buy any sticks? No, I did not. You didn't buy sticks? They weren't very nice sticks. Oh, I no. I forgot to look. Oh, you forgot to buy sticks. sticks. Oh. Like, I saw them, and then I had other stuff I had to buy. Like, I had to buy six new uh, little hides. I had to buy six little water bowls. Um, what else did I get? I bought... Uh, Toffee-covered peanuts, because they were really yummy. This is for snakes to eat? Yeah. Okay. And me. And I bought a ton of rats. Yum. <clears throat> Delicious. Yeah. I love eating rats. Rats are so yummy. Mini nutrients. Man, just think. You are going to be on the next generation of reformed... Um, <laughs> Of re reassembled rat parts. Uh huh. What? Why are you covering your head? Uh huh. <laughs> Long noodle rat. Sorry, for anyone who's not heard 
this factual statement before. Uh, snakes are simply reassembled rats. That's all that they are. They're re <laughs> disassembled and reassembled rat molecules. <laughs> yes. <laughs> they also drink water. Yeah, th they're reassembled and they water and rat, but air. also, but also, uh, rats drink water. Miso also eats birds. He Not eats, here he doesn't. He eats chicken. Yeah, he eats chicken. Wait, really? Yeah, I give him chicken. Oh. He eats little chicks. Oh, that's sad. No, they look nasty. Yeah, because they've probably been, like, fricked up, dude. <laughs> They're frozen. It's just like a, a, a non-processed chicken nugget, you know? It's the it's best you can get. No processing. Uh-huh, instead of being turned into paste. Yeah, he eats a whole chicken nugget. Wow. And he loves it. Does he actually express different levels of preference between rat and chicken? No, he loves all food. <laughs> oh, okay. He did not like the egg I tried to feed him, though. He he was not into the egg. What do you mean? He, I gave him a quail leg. He grabbed it. He was holding it in his mouth. He, like, looked around, and then he literally, like, yeeted it <sighs> across the enclosure. <laughs> <laughs> Really? Like violently ejected it? <laughs> yeah. Like this is the egg. He's like, <laughs> I'm like, what are you doing? He threw it. He threw the egg. <laughs> well, poor guy. <laughs> Don't you dare give him variety. No, he likes. It's a, it's not. It wasn't like done enough. You know, it wasn't cooked enough. Mmm. Oh, he needs he, very cooked, fancy egg. No, he it needs to be more alive. <laughs> oh, he, got it. You know, it has to be uh, grown more. Okay, so I've just spent, like, my entire life doing this. And I have... Yeah, some of the things... Some of the things here are already out again. After I just went through that entire process. He's very fast. That's great. Good for him. Yeah, but it's like it, you can't keep up. It's just not possible. I don't know how. By the way, I will consume this later if you wish to put in refrigerator. Uh, okay. What? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, I'm out of breath, dude. I'm out of breath, and then the chicken's been all frickin' sold, and then I'm back to square one! I'm back to square one! This is gnarly, bro. She got me an energy drink. Yeah, and just like that, it's time to order five more of everything. Ay, caramba. Um, okay, what should I, mm, I'm gonna start surrounding, I'm not buying anything more, I refuse, that was the last order. Oh, you can't do that, I wonder if I could, I wonder if I could surround these dudes in, in boxes. Build a little, build a little box fort around them, you know? What the, go on top. Maybe untrap him? No, but he only goes as fast as customers go. That's the thing. Like, if he went slower, it means we wouldn't have enough for customers to buy. Like, the shelves would be bare. That's what's ridiculous about the whole thing. They purchase things so quickly, you can't possibly keep up. Like, that's... A, it's, it's a real bottleneck problem. Because, let's say you get to the point where you have, like, four cashiers. Um and you had four stalkers or something, right? You can't, you simply cannot keep up with customer demand at that point in the game. It's just, it's actually like too much demand for you to possibly be able to stock, order and stock quickly enough. Not to mention, if you do decide to like order all the product licenses and stuff, then you're just, you're, you're gonna be going out of your mind trying to, stock everything. It's just, like, crazy. Why can't I put the box? 
I can't put the box down. What are you doing? I want up there. We go. Thank you. I can put the box down now. You what? Want a gummy worm? Yes, I would like a gummy worm. Oh, yummy. This is a trolley problem. Because I would eat all of them. And then my trolley. and then my teeth will hurt. I love sour gummy worms. Mm-hmm. Mmm. They're so good, but so if you have many, have then five. no. But I'm saying if I have many and then I brush my teeth, my teeth are like. <laughs> mm-hmm. Thank you. Okay. Oh hey, we're done. How exciting! Balance plus four thousand smackaroos. Wow, eggs went up in price. No way, that's amazing. But Susu went down. Oh, that's barely even a change. Mm, what's my Susu at? Ugh! Oh my god, you're bankrupting me. Are we, uh, how's our bread looking? Have we still can't put that bread down, but like everything else. Bro, we're gonna run out. We're basically out of rice. We're, how are we out of rice? I don't understand. Frick, I'll order five rice. Jesus. Rice. One, two, three, four, five. Purchase. And then start the frickin' day. I mean, to be fair, it is a staple food, but make it come in like smaller... Th I guess to be fair, no. If you go to a grocery store, especially if you go to like a Japanese grocery store, rice come in like bags that are like you're buying soil at Home Depot. <laughs> you get a lot of rice at once. All right, there we go. Yeah, you'd be stocking the heck out of the shelves. Um, mm, gummy worms, though. Okay, I gotta keep building box forts. This is very exciting and important. Gotta bring all of the... Gotta get all the boxes in here now. All right. Gotta build every single one. I wonder if you, like... If you get up into the... Do you hit the ceiling? I guess, yeah, you definitely hit the ceiling. That's fricked up. I don't know if I'm going to have enough boxes to do, like, full enclosure around them. Maybe I should start... Maybe I should make it, like, a, a just a street-facing wall, right? So that we... Because we might run out otherwise. Okay, here we go. I'm just going to make it so that Greg and Greg 2.0 don't have to look at all these people. It It distresses them. Greg and Greg 2.0 prefer their private people. They would much rather... They would much rather, um... Hide behind the box wall. They get to receive a castle. This is my... This is their fallen kingdom. Alright. Greg and Greg 2.0. You guys are gonna get an amazing castle here. Hold on, I gotta... Gotta add more real estate to my house of cards. I mean, cardboards. Yes, Greg and Greg 2.0. They are... They are beyond... The earthly desires of these customers. Ugh. They exist in a realm... That is beyond... Our own. Can I put a box on top there? I should, like... I think I think the layer after this is gonna be these these mans, right? Yeah, it's gonna be that. This will henceforth be known as the realm of the Gregs. No, get in there. Get in there. You customers shall not make eye contact with the legendary Gregs. They're too powerful for you mortal beings. Nobody can scan like like the Gregs can. We just need to be able to stock like mortar in the store or something that would be useful. Okay, come on. What are we do what are we doing here? Get that, get that into place. Get that into place. Come on. 
Let's get you down where you need to be. There we go. Oh god. Oh god. Hold still. Hold still. Supermarket sim is just, it's just a physics engine, really, is all. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Get into, what are you doing? Seriously, what is this? Why would it, why is it being resistant? Why are you resistant to progress? I don't understand. What are you doing? It won't go? It won't let it go. What is happening? Let's get that there. Maybe it'll even the, the plan. I don't know what's going on there. It's been a little picky. Mortars unlocked at level 300? No, that's messed up, dude. Maybe if I get on here, then I'll be able to... There we go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That's good, that's good. I mean, not really perfect. We're starting to lose a little bit of... Uh, Structural stabilization. However, we can just pull back over here on this side, right? There we go. There we go. Brilliant. God, I think still the tall the tall customers can see some of the Gregs. So we gotta keep we gotta keep going. We must keep moving skyward to infinity and beyond. As someone once said. There we go. Good. Help! I'm stuck! Oh, why is it tilting forwards? It's tilting a little forwards, which we don't... Oh, God, they're getting... Oh, no, they're getting in from the storeroom. They're invading from the storeroom. I can't believe this is happening. No! You shall not lay eyes on the Gregs. Oh, my God. He's breaking the rule. I'm sorry, Gregs. I'm so sorry, Gregs. He's not supposed to be here. He's really not supposed to be here, dude. Hold on, let me... Let me see. Can I add more, uh... We add another layer up here. Ooh, it's getting a little dicey there. It's getting a little, a little dicey. <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god! The freezer, the freezer, it saved it. The freezer saved it. It didn't tip. It didn't tip. Wait. Oh my god! Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Can I buy like a? Can I buy like another? Can I buy freezers and stack on top of each other? Wait. Wait, I'm gonna buy a freezer, and I'm gonna purchase, and I'm, I'm gonna see, can you take this, and can you stack it on top of the other freezer for stability? No. Oh, that's kind of, wait, wait, I thought, oh, yes, you can, actually. Oh, you can do the box. You can do the box there for... Oh, I can just buy freaking big boxes and put the boxes in the store. Who cares about the what's in them? I'm just buying expensive boxes. Oh. Yeah, that's good. That's actually pretty good. Let's do another one. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's the Great Wall of Greg getting getting turbocharged right there. That's perfect. I don't want to cheat too much with that, though. You know, I gotta gotta be. What the frick? Why can't you get into get into place? Why can't you get into place? You know, another way that would be to monitor things is, like, you keep looking in the store, and when a shelf starts to run out, you then just order, like, ten of that particular item. That'd be another way to do it. Just trying to think of ways that you can optimize how the whole freaking system works. I can't believe these people think that they can just bother the Gregs like this. What are you doing? Let me place, let me place, let me place. Thank you. Oh, this is good. This is real good stuff right here. This is exactly what we needed. Come on. What are you doing? 
What are you doing? Get into place. Get into place. God dang it. I hate it when it sometimes just won't let you straddle between a couple things. It's kind of the worst. I have to do that, I guess. How did I... How... Okay, I went, I went these ones afterwards. Okay... You're gonna, I'm going to hate myself when I want to move these outside. Oh, there is no moving these outside. There is no need. We are finaleing today. So we are making the most of the Greg Wall of Greg. And that's it. All right, perfect. We're making money. We're making money. Minus all the what we spent on the freezers. Water pizza flour up. Water pizza flour up. All right, we can make a bit more from this. Mm, water. Wow, it way up. Let's go. Water. Where the frick's my pizza? Oh, it's in there. Um, water. Pizza. There we go. Flour. Which flour was it? Was it you? Whew. Way up, baby. Flower, and then Susu down again. Sugar futures are tanking. Holy heck. I don't know what's going on there. Okay. Um, by the way, we had, uh, let's see, Tars22 with four years. Dang, seems like just yesterday I subbed to the Swift quality content for my first time. Hit that like and subscribe sla button slash follow button and the bell to see more. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Rizvita, 200 bits. Guess that $2 delivery fee doesn't matter anymore, does it? I guess not. No. Not with our small loan. Tip of thousand. Thank you for gifting a sub. And um, also 200 bits. Any chance of more started with the crew? I don't know. We shall see. We're doing content warning tomorrow with the Stardew crew. And JX3Fox with a sub. Ellie Seisk, thank you for the three months in advance at a at a subage. Very cool and very awesome, very swick. Yeah, now we'll have Crumb with us to be able to teach us how we actually make good content for Tiki Talk in 2024. We need somebody, we need somebody with that Gen Z mentality to get us to go viral. Otherwise, uh, we're simply not going to make it. There we go. There we go. What else did we, like, run out of? Any, uh, did we run out of salt? Dang, we ran out of salt already? No, there's no way. There's no way. I had so much salt. Can I, like... Can I straddle these boxes? Can I straddle these boxes? Or is it going to be idiot about it? No, that should work. Yeah, that works. That works. There we go. There we go. How's the storeroom looking, by the way? Shelves are bare. I have no more susu. Holy frick. I have no more chicken, no more susu. Yeah, it's just ordering simulator, man. That's all it is. Box ordering simulator. No, my wall! <gasps> oh, God, no. The Great Wall of Greg has fallen. Oh, no, dude. This is one of the biggest disasters of our time. Few things... Few things are more tragic than the collapse of the Great Wall of Greg. They will write about this in the history books. And I even added support. I even added support and it still didn't work. How is it possible? But I, don't worry. I can fix this. I can fix this. Wait, wait, up here. There we go. Perfect. That'll be good. That'll be good. I need some other boxes, though. Do you have any more? We do have a few. Thank goodness. OK. 
Okay. Gotta level it out, level it out, you know. Come on. Come on. Get into place. Perfect. This part over here, though. Okay. We'll get through this. We will rebuild. I know we can rebuild. There we go. We are going to rebuild stronger than we were before. Much, much stronger than ever. Perfect. Perfect. It's already looking sturdier than before. The Great Wall of Greg is coming together beautifully. The kingdom is rising. Perfect. Oh my god. They never have to make eye contact with anyone ever again. They're safe from humanity. Merely have to interact with themselves, the product, and the money. You guys are heroes. Absolute heroes and saviors of humanity. The Gregs, everybody. Look at them. Look at the Gregs operating in their prime, their prime element. Incredible work right there. Incredible work. Wow. Shout out to the Gregs. Dude, let's even add some more. Let's even add some. <gasps> okay, maybe maybe it was good that way, and we don't want to push it too much because that 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 got a little dicey. Yikes. Okay. Whew. Saved it. Saved it. Saved it. God, that 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 was almost a that was almost a disaster, but it's okay. Okay. It's nice of you guys to queue up inside the boxes. Well done. Well done. Whoo! All right. $5,700. It's like just about enough for us to restock everything again. You know? You know, how, how big do you think we can make the pile of boxes outside of the store with, uh, with $5,700 on us? I think, let's try ordering, um, let's just start ordering ten of things until we run out of money and see how it looks. You think I can take, I don't know if it'll let me take another loan, but god dang, if I can lever up again, let's pursue the American dream. Oh my god, I can take another loan! And another loan! I can take all the loans! This is amazing! Wow! God, I love levering up. Let's go. I can get like 10 of everything. Order. And 10 of the bread. Order. 10 of you. Oh, it's going to be, it's going to be glorious. It's going to be glorious. Dude, you're so right. I mean, it is. It's literally just free money if you delete the app afterwards. That's all that you have to do, right? If you have if you have a loan app and it's like, oh, you owe $10,000... We'll delete the app, and then what can they do about it? Nothing. Oh, no! Closed after 9 p.m. What was I ordering? I was ordering Malk. Well, I guess we'll get to the Malk in the morning. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm not going to touch it. I'm not going to touch it until we have ordered everything. Why click so much? Just change the amount of things? What do you mean? I would still have to click... Or does it stay there? Oh, does it just stay? Oh, it just stays like that. Oh, that's awesome. Why does it let you click beyond the 10? Well, I can just get this ready while he's still checking out. And then I can just one click here. 
I don't understand. Why, why does it let you bother to order more than 10 when you actually can't order more than 10? That seems a little silly. Oh, wait. Can I just... Oh, I can just type the frick. I can just type it. Oh, I can just type it. Let's go, baby. And now it doesn't reset, right? Oh, it stays at 10. Let's go. That is... That is the true pile. If I keep ordering then maybe we can just make it to the glass ceiling without having to do any engineering whatsoever. Just trying to make sure it doesn't get mixed up with the other boxes, right? I can throw away the empty boxes, but it's... they're souvenirs at this point. Souvenirs of a bygone era. We may not be attempting to fort anymore because, well... We hit the glass ceiling, but we can still remember our roots and where we came from. You can throw them with R? <gasps> you can! Oh my god, you really can. Wow. That is incredible. The more you know. Yeet! Yeet! Yeet. Big Yeetus. Big Yeetus. Big Yeetus. Big Yeetus. And are you done? Good job, guys. Good job, Gregs. You're doing Gregged. Wow, plus $7,000, because loans! Incredible work. Um, Chrisid, thank you for the 14 months. Uh, potato down. Susu down. Susu down again? Oh my god, dude. Sugar Futures, what is happening? The Susu has gone from like $7 to $4. It's as volatile as gas prices. Holy frick. Actually, though, I think chocolate right now is actually going crazy. Um, okay. Malk. Buy it. T. Buy it. God, that is expensive. Peanut butter. That is also expensive. Buy it. Flour. Buy it. Two piggies. $500. Wow. Buy it. Add. Boom. Purchase. We order in bulk now. Bulk only. Boom. Purchase. Butter. Purchase, don't need that. Chicken, take up the entire storeroom with the 10 chicken. French fries, purchase. De Niro, $875 of pizza. Oh my god. 10, 10 pallets of pizza, 800 bucks. Well, this is what it looks like, everybody. This is what it looks like to order 10 of everything. It's a, it's a beautiful... Beautiful sight to see. Oh my god. Wow. Wowie zowie. Hold on, that's good. I don't even know if I'm going to use any of these for thumbnails, but um... Oh, hey, we're closed. Let's open back up, everybody. Hey, surely I can just, you know, load everything back up and not be in excruciating pain in doing this. Where's my pizza? My pizza's like there and stuff. And then no more pasta. Oh, we're out of pasta again. Oh my God, we're out of pasta. Holy frick. We're out of everything. Do the dupe glitch? What do you mean the dupe glitch? I have no idea what the dupe glitch is. Never heard of it before. I have another stack of pizza. Pizza, 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 pizza. Mmm, throw them from outside? Oh, yeah, we could, like... They need to have multiplayer, so you can, like, fireman's, uh, handoff for these things. Just block the store room entry. Throwing boxes at customers, you know how it is. You pack the cash registers and reload the day. Oh, gotcha. Eh. Eh. It's 
kind of what I have skis, you know? It's kind of what I have skis. Let's do a little bit of that. And a little bit of rice. And a little bit of the shocky beak. And a little bit of a little bit of debt. And a little bit of debt. And a little bit of I just don't understand like how are we already out of, of things. I just don't get it. I just I simply I simply do not get. It means that like I have I have obviously like done I have done this much box packing times like a bajillion over the course of the entirety of the thing. Oh my god, I just look at this and I'm like, why? Why would I do this? Why am I here? Why am I still restocking? Why am I... Every time I think I'm out, they pull me back in. Why am I still... I don't need to be doing this right now. I've retired. Like, it's unnecessary. And yet I see the boxes, and I must put them on shelves. If I see box, it must go shelf. There is... Simply no other options. Oh wait, I forgot to increase the prices on the things that are... Okay, the oil, the the oil, the chalky peak, and that was it. Oil and chalky peak go burr. Okay, oh, that's already kind of what it is. What it is, and chalky peak go. Oh my God, I've been giving you giving away the chalky peak. What the frick balls? Eight point five. There we go. I, and dude, I'm I'm like I'm like Stockholm syndrome, right? This is my home where I stock the items, so it's just crazy. And then uh, that goes there, and then her, and then the eggies go there. I carumba, and then the pasta is still just getting out of stock. And then, why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? Why am I doing this? I mean, so you can just do this all the way up to, I'm going to hire another man. We're at level 23. Wowie zowie. Hey, management, growth, hiring, hire another restonky boy who's going to have like nothing to do because he's just going to be, <laughs> he's going to be like, wait a minute. The other guy is like way faster than me. Why is he so fast at doing this? I bet you'd be it'd be quite a trick to be able to get both restonkers like in the same place. All right, good luck there, buddy. Good luck. You're going to be like super inefficient. Why am I paying you the same amount that I'm paying the other guy? Oh wait, that's pizza. That's the Robert De Niro right there. Uh more pizza. And then the french fries. Why am I still doing? I don't know why I'm still doing this to myself. Why am I still doing this to myself? There's so many boxes. We're never going to get through all the boxes. But the store is still going to have some items. Now the coffee's out of stock. Why is the coffee out of stock if I just bought all this stuff? Nobody knows. Nobody knows how it's possible. The solution here is to become a specialty store. Only sell one specific thing. Nothing else. Don't sell any other stuff. Only sell the one thing. And then people will be like, wah, wah, you don't carry my favorite thing. And I'll be like, yeah, well, guess what? You ever deal with Trader Joe's growing up? You bet not. Because as soon as you like something, Trader Joe's is like, oop, we ain't stocking that no more. Maybe it's different lately. That's how, that's how it was, dude. When I was younger, my mom would always shop at Trader Joe's. And she'd be like, man, I love this thing that I just found there. And then next week, oh, they've stopped carrying it. That's unfortunate. Oh, good, I'm trapped outside. Where the frick's my Wawa? There it is. And then, man, 
I barely make a dent. And the day still progresses. It really is going insane simulator. 2024. You're right, it got dark because the solar eclipse uh, came here early. Way earlier than, than real life. The solar eclipse hits this area of the of the world. Oh, that's full. Um, that's fine. I'll add more to there. That'll be fine. We're out of coffee. Jesus. More... More nut butter, more two piggies, more cheesy peasy lemon squeezy, more cheesy peasy lemon squeezy, more flour. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm, I'm full. I'm full. I mean, we're making money. We're making money, but at what cost? But at what cost? Second stalker, please take the boxes from out here and put them into the storage room. Oh my god, just do that for me, please. Can you just do that for me? If you could just do that, it would be great. Thank you. Has anyone actually made it to level 100? Because if they do, they are a stronger willed person than I am. <laughs> this is my store. This is how my storeroom is going to end with a pile of boxes in front of it, empty shelves that simply run out before I have the ability to keep them, keep them up. Oh, the G the old jumpin' yeet. That's the strat right there. Yeah! The old jumpin' yeet. There we go. You finished, uh, ringing people up? Sounds like the Gregs are finished. We go on audio now. Total profit. Minus a lot of money. Oh, good. Everything simply decreases in price. This is the nature of the game now. I'm actually like super strong though to be able to just keep eating. And it just keeps going in and just goes and goes and goes and goes and goes. Huh. <sighs> <sighs> it just disappears. It just disappears into this stack of boxes flooding over the doorway. And I'm not e this is not even like halfway. Ugh. How did we get here? Why is it like this? This is what it feels like to play Minecraft without applied energistics or refined storage or Tom's simple storage. Oh my god. <laughs> it's time to sell oil only. Yeah, I believe that is called being a gas station or a petrol station. Whatever you call it in your locale. Um. <sighs> Ah, ah, I missed. I missed. We're starting to overflow. Get in there. Get in there. I love seeing the people just like emerge from the boxes. Come on, get in there. Oh man, I'm trying to like score a bucket inside the 
Yeah, I made it in. We can take the small ones and we can... Yeah, make it in. He's scoring buckets. Yeah, nothing but net. Yes. It's like, uh, it's like playing basketball in Plasmophobia. Yes. Oh no. Come on. Yeah, scoring buckets. Let's go. Yes. Perfect. Oh, not perfect. He emerges. He emerges from the rubble. God, I'm just actually scoring mad buckets here. No, that one didn't work. Oh, man. How's it look in there right now? Let me just check. God, our shelves are bare. <laughs> oh, what a mess. Why? Why is it this way? God. Everybody, I think we've done... We've done just about all we can with this game. Within the limits of my sanity. So, I think this... Maybe where we bid farewell. It's been fun. I've had a good time, but we've hit the limitations of what we can do. Um, shout out to, yeah, shout out to anyone who is uh, stocking shelves IRL. I do like being able to acquire um, items to consume, and um, you make it so that uh, we can do that. So. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2, follow twitch.tv slash Captain Sparkles, and um, stay tuned for whatever comes next in the land of gaming. This has been Supermarket Simulator, signing out.